Welcome back to my YouTube channel Score and Shine. In this video, I will be teaching you all about Brinjol. Now let's get into the video. The scientific name of Brinjol is Solanum melongena and belongs to the family Solanaceae. It is popularly called as eggplant because of its appearance and its origin is from India. It is grown as an annual vegetable and it can also be grown as perennial vegetable but because of its reduction in yield due to diseases and pests it has been growing as annual vegetable and hence it is an annual and it is a day neutral plant where an intermediate day length of nearly 12 to 14 hours is required for its growth and it is non-climatic in nature where it experiences the decline in rate of respiration at the time of harvesting or maturity and it is a very good source of vitamin B and you can also observe anthocyanin pigment and glycoalkaloids present in brinjol which is the reason why brinjol is bitter in taste. Dry fruits of brinjol contain goitrogenic principle and hence consuming of dry fruits of brinjol should be strictly avoided and white brinjols are mostly preferred by diabetics patients. And the next thing is brinjol consists of bi-directional root system where the roots penetrates in both the directions and here comes the most important thing according to exam point of view is heterostyle brinjol is heterostyle in nature heterostyle is the condition where the stamens or the pollen of the flower could not reach the stigma of the same flower because of the difference in their lengths and here you can see the stamen and here you can see the stigma where the stigma is style and stigma is long where the pollen and stamen could not reach the style and the stigma and hence this condition is called as heterostyle in brinjol you can observe four types of heterostyle in nature that is four types of style nature where first one is it contains long style and it also contains larger ovary and the next one is medium style which contains medium length style and it contains medium sized ovary and the next one is Zudo short style which contains short style and a rudimentary ovary and the next one is very short styled uh, nature one which is it contains very short style and it also contains rudimentary ovary and hence four types of styles can be seen in Brinjal. Okay well coming on to the fruit type it contains a fleshy berry type. Okay temperature nearly 21 to 28 degrees Celsius has to be required for growing of brinjal and seed rate is varieties require 200 to 250 grams of seed rate per hectare and for hybrids 100 to 150 grams of seeds per hectare is required and while coming on to spacing varieties need space of about 16 to 60 centimeter and hybrids need space of about 75 into 75 centimeter next now let us see the important varieties and hybrids of brinjal and i will tell you a tip now the hybrids or varieties which where the name starts with PUSA has been released by IARI and the varieties or hybrids where the name starts with ARCA has been released by IIHR and now the variety PUSA purple long PUSA purple long is an extra long and early maturing variety where it matures earlier and next is PUSA purple round Punjab Bahar and next is Pant Samrat Pant Samrat is Formopsis blight and bacterial blight resistant variety and black beauty black beauty is nematode resistant variety and anamalai anamalai which is highly recommended for growing in tamil nadu is aphid resistant variety as i earlier said you arka nidhi and arka shield which has been released by iihr where arka shield is little leaf of brinjal resistant variety little leaf of brinjal is phytoplasma disease okay well coming on to hybrids Pusa Krant, Pusa Bindu, Hisar Jamuni, Pusa Anupak are some of the important hybrids and yield varieties yield up to 250 to 350 quintals per hectare and hybrids yield up to 450 to 550 quintals per hectare. Now let us see the, the major and important insect pests and also diseases. Well coming on to insects, fruits and fruit and shoot borer which is very important pest. The scientific name of it is Eucinoids arbonalis, which belongs to the family Pyralidae, is the major pest where it causes dead heart in the young plants by damaging the stem of the brinjal plant. And at later stage, at the maturity stage, where the brinjal forms, the 
shoot and shoot and shoot borer makes bore holes and enters into the bridge wall and here you can see how the damage caused by it and it damages the entire vegetable and the next one is hada beetle ephilagna bignito punctata belongs to the family coccinellidae is hada beetle and brown leaf hopper which is the vector for little leaf of brinjal in this picture you can see the disease caused in which is little leaf of brinjal brown leaf hopper and it is scientifically called as cestius physitis is the responsible for causing the for is the vector responsible for causing the little leaf of brinjal and formopsis blight is the disease here in this picture you can see how the damage is created and it damages the entire vegetable